everyone and welcome back to Skyrim. Yes, welcome back. I I play a bit offline because I don't actually record everything I do in Skyrim. So I was back at the house, you know, in my house clothes. Wandered around the house, got rid of the rats in the basement. Uh, you know, swanned about in my slippers, sorted out my inventory, all those lovely bits and pieces. But after a little while off adventuring, I think it's time to read on our armor and get right back into it okay i think it's time for rochelle lady to fire to go back and relive her Someone days of high it. adventure like thank you ayala and let us go onward to skyrim yes if you're also anyone who watches my channel diligently and if you do thank you very much i greatly appreciate it you're probably the only one uh You'll notice my, my level is slightly different than when it was before. Yes, because I played a bit off work, off on, online while I was waiting for files to process and render and upload. Because it's a great game just to play as you're doing something in the background. And I got up a level, leveled up some of my illusion and smithing and all that bloody bloody wah stuff. So, let us get right back into it. Where I have a cool little quest I discovered off record that we are going to finish. Right, yeah, I don't want to look at your ugly face, troll. Like, I don't want to actually look at you at all. I'll look at you like that. Because the other way I see your ass, and it's disgusting. So I'll look at you like that. I'll look at your, your side profile picture. Disgusting, ugly troll. There we go. Now I don't see his face at all. Great. Awesome. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's night time, Serana. It can't be. Oh, really? Piss off. Out my lawn. Get off my lawn, you bloody wolves. Okay, where are we going? I have my quest. Nope. Start button. Quests. Lost to the ages. Soul for the Ethereum shards. Map. Uh, where are we going? Uh, um, um, I think I've been there. Damn it, I don't remember what I was doing. Okay, uh, treasure, yeah, I've done that. Three or four. Where have I been? Damn it, it doesn't tell me where I've been. I've done three of these already, I've forgotten where I've been. I, I either need to go to here, or I need to go to here. It's one of these two. Damn it, I have to check my journal. <laughs> Just imagine my... The fiery, the dragon, legendary dragonborn, Rashara, Lady of Fire, standing outside their house looking at a journal going, What did I do? Where am I? Where is it? Oh, it's K. It's K. It's K. Yeah. Katria's. Katria's journal. Okay. Now, I've done five. I've done three. Done one. I'm confident I did two. So it's four. No, did I? Fuck, I know what it looks like, the one I did off record. So let's fast travel to this one. If it looks the same, then I know I'm on the I'm on the wrong track. Right. And away. And yes, apologies about the loading screens. Blame consoles. Actually, don't blame consoles because they're great. Blame Bethesda for being biased against consoles. Especially PlayStation. I love you guys, but here's day. You're really great, but fuck you for that shit. Seriously, I don't. I f seriously think that his day is racist against PlayStation users. We all know how many a year and a half it took for Dawn Guard to reach the PlayStation and all the other Skyrim DLCs, and we all know how glitchy and buggy the PS3 versions of Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas are when compared to the PC or the Xbox versions. So I honestly think they are a bit biased. Which is sad, because Bethesda is actually one of my favourite developers. Sucker Punch, Bethesda, and Deep Silver are my favourite video game developers. A THQ actually would have kicked Bethesda off my top three list, but they went out of business, sadly. I don't think... I think this is a, the, the... Yes, this isn't the same place. Okay, because the other one had a different room. Alright, we're good to go in. Alright, we're on the right track. Yeah, I met I met this weird ghost lady, and she's like, 
Oh, I've just stumbled on some weird dwarven artifacts. And after going through a really badass, awesome dwarven tomb, I was like, sweet. And then she's like, we've got to find the four shards to unlock the magic place. So I got three of them off, off record while I was waiting for my Red Dead Redemption video. That's probably been up for a while to uh, render. Because believe it or not, the most processor-intensive records I do are in Red Dead Redemption. Because it's such a cinematic game that the record files take up ages. Um, well, the doors aren't here. So how do I get in? Oh, I'm confused. Is this the right place? It's got to be. Is there another dwarven thing lower down? Do I have to do some more exploring? Because I know, I know this is the... This has got to be the right place, because it's where it is on the map. Hmm, I'm confused. Also, this glass axe on the screen looks retarded. It does not look very effective at all. It looks more decorative. I mean, the blades... If she, Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't seem like an effective combat weapon. Just by looking at it. It looks a bit too crude. And while some of it makes sense, like the holes in the middle you could use to... If you had a sword blade inside, you could use to wrench it and rip it out the other person's hand. But it's such a short weapon. Okay, where are we going? If I can't get into there, then what am I do? Oh. Okay. The Ethereum Wars. Oh, that's the book that I read that started me on this quest, actually. Uh, where are we? If we can't get in here, where are we going? I could glitch jump up the mountain, I suppose. Maybe, well, maybe it's somewhere around here. Unless this door says what I think it's saying. Oh, damn it, this is the place I went to yesterday. <laughs> when I teleported here, it teleported me right here. And then the arrow was right on that door there. Damn it, this is the same place, Serana. We fucked up. Oh, back to fast traveling. God damn it. I was like, how can I not get in there? I was in here earlier. Well... By wasting seven minutes of your time, and me being a moron, by process of elimination, it must mean that the place we have to go is this one. Man, I'm dumb. Ooh, scary vampire lord. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, so how could it fly? It has, its wings are just bones. There is no actual wing membrane on it. That thing should not be able to fly. Innkeeper can usually point you to local quests. Yes, and he can give you alcohol. Delicious, delicious alcohol. I'm a big scary vampire. I'm a big scary vampire lord. I'm a big scary vampire lord. Yuck, I'm ugly. Doot doot. <sighs> and let us sing the Skyrim loading music screen. Oh, no. The, sc the Skyrim loading music song it does not need to be sung in this particular case. Right. Where are we going, Sarana? This is obviously the place. But what do we need to do once we get in here? Afflicted. Uh, what? Ugh. The fuck? The fuck is happening here? Oh, wait. I fucking remember. A Daedric cult lives in here, don't they? I don't want to talk to Nurgle. I don't want to talk to Nurgle and his diseases. I just want the Dwarven part. Damn it. Also, I don't see any arrow direct me as to where I need to go. Are we sure this is the right place? I think it, it's got to be. Oh, Dragon! Apologies, Mr. Dragon. I was so distracted. Let's play fire. Oh, it's an elder dragon. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's taking my health down. Damn it. Did I not bring my fire resistance fire? My fire resistance potions. Oh, yep. Take that. Uh, take some health potion. Let's just... It's just poison. It's not poison. Let's just take a lot of potions. <laughs> just imagining chugging more of these poisons. Potent fear poison. 
don't know why I keep all these potions around. Maybe I'll need them one day. Oh, I had it on favorites, damn it. That's dumb, okay. And let's grab my bow. Come on, dragon. So I'm gonna use shitty... Damn, my full foom. Did like nothing to it. Come on. Oh, what? You? why do you land up there? Come back here. Come back here. You could land in here. So what's in this? Unlock door. Boo. Um, you know what? Stuff this door and ruin for the moment. We're gonna chase this dragon. Come on, Savannah. We're gonna chase the dragon. Chase the dragon, chase the dragon, chasing a dragon. Aw, oh, poo! Oh, stinky. Damn it, the dragon ran. What I managed to do was hit one arrow and a flame shout on it. Okay, um. Uh. Let's just open the liver. Why won't, isn't the door going? Oh. Traps, fuck you. Oh. Right. Oh, sorry, Serana. Didn't mean to stab you like that. Okay. Um. Um. Fucking Daedra. Lovely. Fuck you, Daedra. Oh, the afflicted seemed to die the second it got near Nurgle or Hamea or the pest Daedra whatever the fuck it is, I'm just going to call him Nurgle, because that makes more sense to me. His powers, he died. Also, wait, check, no, check my map. I am swear this has got to be the right place. Books. Yeah. Uh. Uh, yep. There's our two. It's up by here. It is. Markov's got to be there. I'm pointing to the screen, but you can't see it. So it must be up here. Uh, how am I any wrong? Let's give you some something to this after all. Couldn't make it out much. Uh, okay. Check the map. Right. Following the map's logic. Yeah, the map's logic because it goes in. It look like it goes in, then back around again. So it's got to be this. This is these are the only dwarven ruins nearby. These are the only dwarven ruins nearby. What what is this? I'm confused. There are no other entrances or ways in. I uh, what's going on? Got to be got to be here. Oh, the dragon's still here. Oh, Mr. Dragon, I I missed you. Come back. Let's be friends. Let's be friends, Mr. Dragon. Glitch jump, glitch jump, glitch jump. Glitch jump. Meet the glitch jumps. They're the modern video game glitch. Glitch jumps. Meet the glitch jumps. They're in every sort of sandbox game. Glitch jump. Meet the glitch jump. The Hesda seems to have loved them very much. Oh, dragon! Where are you going, dragon? You're over here! Good, well, I'm going up to meet you. If you could just give me a minute to glitch jump off my way up this hill. Glitch jump, glitch jump. Yes, please stop. Fly. Don't flame me. I'm kind of in the middle of trying to get to where you've been hanging out. Aha! Uh -huh, Alright, I'm on the plateau. Now I can take you down. No, bad elder dragon. Get back here. Land on the ground so I can kill you. Oh, you evil dragon. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting burned again. Uh, potions. Healing. Uh, let's, let's try and hit him with a, some poison. No, up. Damn it. Just a mu Oh, no, wait. I have poison down the bottom. Seriously, how big a bag of potions and poisons am I carrying? I'm just do a weak poison. Just why not? Ah! Damn it, I cannot see for the fire. I only have one poison arrow shot. Come on, dragon. Come on, dragon. Come on, dragon. Hover. 
Fire! Got it. Okay. This is not getting us anywhere. We need Dragon Rand. Damn it. I'm getting my ass burned. And I know I'm only level 43 and my armor is actually, though it's got fire resistance, isn't the best. But give me a break. Alright, let's just get... Oh, and I took away my dragon killing sword as well. I had that sword that gives you dragon killing. Uh, we will quickly enchant that with a common soul gem. And we will grab that and our shield. Alright, come on, freaking elder dragon. Here you are, land. Land so that I may destroy you. Come on. I've killed bigger dragons than you. Are oh, you going to land? No. You're not. You're just going to be a dick. Fuck you. Get back down here. Don't make me call up my friends. Get back here. Get back here. Come on. Land. Yeah. Now look how fast you go down to my blade. Die, you asshole. This is a better fight. Ah. Indeed, Serana. It was very good teamwork by us. We are the best tag team ever. Alright. I don't really need that. Ah. Okay, Serana. We'll go find a cave or something. Just let me get this creature's soul. Ah, oh, delicious, delicious souls. We're still trying to figure out that puzzle, though. It's got to be around here. It just makes... That's the only dwarven ruin nearby. Um, I'll keep wandering this way, because I want to see what's over there. But, I am I swear... Is that a dwarven ruin? It looks dwarven. Hmm, maybe, maybe I was on... I was wrong. Uh... We'll see. If the arrow marker shows up, because it shows up to help you that point you out that you are actually at the right place, then maybe we're right. Okay, let's get my sword. Oh, we are at the right place. Okay, I'm just dumb. Oh, thank you, game. I've never... I, I don't know this place. Never been here before. How the hell can I... Oh, I've stated this many times that this is a game where you can just keep playing it and you'll always discover new things. But, how would I never know that such a thing was here? Oh, there's a dwarven sword and a helmet? Oh, a shard. Where are you, ghost? There you are. <laughs> so, it is at this point where my audio died and refused to tell me. So now you're just going to listen to me two days on editing this, dubbing over it badly. And normally you'd say, well... You could delete the footage and refilm it. No, because I save it after every time I make a video, just in case I lose the, I lose my playthrough. And then the second thing you could say is, wait a minute, why don't you just silently dub over it without bringing up the fact that you're dubbing over it and exposing these massive plot holes for this train wreck to go through? Well, in that case, I would tell you that. A, you're going to tell I'm dubbing it over anyway, so may as well just draw attention to it rather than you question what's wrong. And B, I like to actually add my fuck-ups into the videos. A, I'm not going to delete this because it's actually a decent video on my account. And B, I think that keeping my fuck-ups in actually shows I have a soul and not just some mindless YouTube Let's Playing generator. Because if you look at the started this channel was literally the first time I ever tried to record everything and in hindsight it's shit so as you go on through my videos you can see I get slowly better and better and better and every time I include a fuck up I like well I make a fuck up I like to include it just to show you the growth and the evolution as I go along that and I'm really lazy and can't be bothered you know fully dubbing it properly so with all this being dumped on you and this loading screen not getting us anywhere fast Let's get back into the video. With the hindsight of two days ago. Alright. Oh yes, I remember. I was like, dude, I've been here before. I oh, I never knew that this was, like there was anything here. How do you get this to work? Oh, okay. And then I was like, oh, this looks awesome. And I was like, where's Catria? I don't see her anywhere. Um, where is she? What, what am I doing? And then we go, yep. <laughs> give, it, give it a try. <laughs> try taking it out. 
gentlemen, that's... I'm not going to go into that one. Whoa. <laughs> I forgot about this. Oh, I remember. I was like, I'm standing clear. Is this clear enough? Hello? And it's like, holy shit. Those dwarves do some pretty fucking sweet architecture. Alright, let's it's go, everybody. True. Come on. Into the thing. Sword activate. Alright, come on. There you are, Katrina. Wait, Serana. Where are you, Serana? Serana! There you are. Alright, let's go. No, no, stand out there. Come inside. In yes, there you go. Katria? Kat ah, fuck it, it'll do. Away we go! Slow motion loading screens. Slow motion loading screens. Slow motion loading screens. God, they're bloody annoying in this game. Uh, come on. Don't make me sing the loading screen song more. Come on. Game. Game? Seriously, why do you take this long to load? It makes no logical sense. Well, actually, I suppose it does, because I've never been to this place before, so it would, it would have to render a whole new environment. Oh, this was me going, Oh, I saw the lever. Where's the lever? Where's the lever? Where's the... It's, it's a banner. Where's the... Where's the lever? Is it over here? I don't see it. And then me being an idiot and going, Maybe it's in here. Where's the lever gone? No. Hmm. Where is it? Is it... Is it, like, on this wall? Or is it back in here? Oh, no. It's there. I'm just dumb. And we open the door. And I go, hell yeah, look, central irrigation. These doors are smart. And look, automatic magic lighting lanterns. It's futuristic space technology like this that kept the dwarves ahead until they decided to piss off Daedra and get themselves stuck to another dimension. Oh, look at those lights. They're pretty cool. 4,000 years. Ooh, loot. Nice. 4,000 years. That's actually quite a long time actually thinking about it and I'm amazed that these ruins are so well preserved for 4,000 years oh yeah me thinking this was a trap <laughs> and trying to break it I was like it, it's a trap it's got to be no it's not okay and then me going ooh look at the precious architecture and then I remember I spent I said how did I get a tree to grow on the ground it makes no logical sense all right where are we going past me where are we going Okay, the resonators, the things above you. No, above you, moron. No, above, no, that's the table. No, above you. No, no, above you. That's a door. Past me, you're a bit of an idiot. Where are you going? It's a lake. That's Katria. Now, you don't need to ask her, it's those things above you, remember? This is it. Yeah. Okay, thank you for that exposition, but it, they're above you, previous me. See, those things. Now you've got it. Good work, previous me. Idiot. Alright, now hit them. And, no, I said hit them. Really? You can't hit at point blank range. Okay, you're an idiot. Back up. Yeah, then fire. Use your aim ability. There you go. Right. Uh, I think we can all agree that previous me was a bit of a twat. There you go. The doors are open. Genius. Alright. More sweet lighting. Ooh. It almost feels like... Like what? You can't just end a sentence like that and not tell me. What? The, the air is non-breathable? The air is tainted? What? <laughs> oh, yes. And this is where I thought the game crashed. Actually, in hindsight, I should have actually started checking this, because... Yeah. Ooh, loot. Very good. Uh, open the door. Oh, dude, look at that. That looks awesome. Alright. <laughs> yeah, we, we're going to be in for a bit of a fight here. I, I have my sneaking suspicion. Alright. Let's clear out the steam. Why do the dwarves always obsess about Steam? I mean, it is a very good platform for PC gaming, but you don't need to build the entire system around it. 
Alright, turn off the steam. Okay, where are we going now? Are we going to have a look at the forge? Sweet. Um, earthquakes? Uh, is this safe? Oh. They blocked our only escape. Hooray! Ooh, guardians of the forge. What? Warp dwarven spiders. Um, what are they warped by? Are they possessed by demons? A Daedra here. I really don't want to have to deal with chaos possessed machinery. I had enough time dealing with those dark mechanicum dicks. Alright, uh, hammer. It's hammer time. Smash them skulls in. Their robot skulls in. Ow, where did they come from? Over here. I'll help you out, Sana. Ow. Oh. Well, you did it before me. Ah, oh, you keep killing everything before me. Alright, take this, you dwarven spear. Ooh. Ooh, bolts. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. Ooh, shit. Ah, uh, steam. Ah, uh, shut it off, shut it off, shut it off. I don't want everyone to die. Oh, I hit X. Go, 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 go. Oh, get out of my way. Get out of my way. Shut the steam off. Yes. Alright, is everyone alright? Ah, I can't I have to fight for you guys. Get away. Is everyone alright? Alright. Nice. Oh, past me, you seem to be a bit more organized. No, don't. Your companions are in danger, you dick. Okay, Savannah's alive. I was gonna say, your companions are in danger. Don't loot everything, you asshole. Alright. Nice. Oh, another, another sphere. Smash it. Excellent. Whoa, what what was that? What was that? Ooh, the forge. Uh, there's something coming out the lava. Oh, shit. Uh, that ain't good. 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 No, no. Yes, no. No, no. No, 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 no. Yes, that might actually help with my hammer. Yeah, uh, die, you evil giant lava monster. Die. Oh, I'm down like a chump. Loot. Uh, emerald. Nice. I'll take that. <laughs> Look, he just slowly sinks back into the lava. Never to be seen again. Oh, you ruined the moment. Oh, you did ruin the moment, but yes, we did. Okay, we can prove it actually works. After 4,000 years, I don't think it's going to work somehow. Just a theory. Just an inkling, maybe. Yeah, how do we do that? I actually said that. My previous self said that. He's like, how do we do that? And then the character dialogue box came up. How do we do that? And I was like, dude, this is some meta shit right here. Well, there's got to be some Aetherium around somewhere, just in hindsight, because... They allow you to build free things from the forge. So, logically, there must be some more Aetherium around. Ooh, chest. Nice. Dwarven ingots. Ooh, ebony. Gold. I'll just take all of it. And I don't need... Ooh, might take a bit more dwarven metal. Ooh. And I remember in my previous self was like, Ooh, can I make like a super mega um, ebony sword? I have four ebony ingots. I should be able to make like a mega daedric sword or something from this. And then I go, all right, gonna make a sword. And go miscellaneous and go, ah, oh, what? That's all you can do. I'm like, ooh, that crown looks pretty good. I mean, you can use two standing stones. Ooh, but the sh mm, shield looks, I don't know. I don't know. Stuff looks pretty cool. Don't. I kind of like. A dwarven spider or sphere for 60 seconds, it doesn't seem really worth it in my opinion. I mean, it's kind of just sort of, it looks cool, and it's fancy, but eh, I'd rather stick with the shield, though. Becoming ethereal for 15 seconds, eh, good for crowd control, but not really good for much else. Just stick to the crown. Two standing stones is awesome. There's a crown worthy of the last dragonborn, or an emperor, but you know, we won't go into that one. This is a beautiful crown. Kind of a pity you died, so you can no longer use it. Well, you can't use it. But, oh well. It is. It's true. We have living evidence of what we have found. What do we do now? Well, so I love Sarana just, you know, scratching her chin going, Hmm, I'm very puzzled but interested about what's going on here. 
Yes, congratulations. All right. Well, that's awesome. Good luck. Oh, good luck, Katrina. I will see you again in Sovereign Guard. That I will. Because I may end up there myself. Ooh, and I bow to you also. All right. Well, what do you think about this, Serana? Oh, you don't have any no. cool extra lines. Boo. Ooh. Well, I suppose we just better get those bolts off these guys. No. No. Some of these guys have got to have door and crossbow bolts. Oh, yes. No. No. Oh, trophy. wonder what that one is. Oh, wait. I, I don't actually remember what that one is. Who cares? All right. Well, I think that's everything. Hmm. That lava does look pretty sweet. Must admit, I like the texturing. It makes it look like real lava. Can I make anything else? Can I make anything else? No. Boo. You suck. You're not a normal forge. You can only work in the Aetherium. Ooh. Yes. Ruby. Uh, where else? Mm, nothing interesting over here. What is my past self doing? They're sort of running around being a spaz. Oh no, I think my previous self is about to end the video. Ah, uh, taking off the helmet. Clear sign that they're ending the video. Oh, you're putting on your shield? Oh, you're getting your sword out. Okay, so you want a, you want a fancy ending, do you, previous me? Well, yeah, the camera won't work like that. You can't get all of it in frame. No, yeah, no, that doesn't work. No, it doesn't really... Yeah, it doesn't work. Stand back away from the fort. There you go, previous me. Right. Yes, that's a good shot. Yep, that's good. Okay, you've got it. Yeah, you got yourself, you got Serana in frame. Everything is good. So I think that all that's left to say is thank you very much for watching, guys. Uh, next video you will have... Uh, you will not have previous me, you will have present me. So with that being said, thank you very much for watching guys, and I will see you all again another time.